Hi everyone, welcome back to Beyond Your Knowledge. Today we're going to be reviewing folate and methionine cycle. Well, before we continue, I would like to share with you Proverbs 21, 17 and says that whoever loves pleasure will be a poor man. He who loves wine and oil will not be rich. Okay, so in this name, so we need to love God with all. So folate and methionine cycle. So basically we're going to do two cycles. So one is going to be right here and then the other is going to be right there, okay? So yeah, so basically the, 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 they are going to be, yeah, so one right there, yeah, right here, and one is called folate cycle and then there is methionine cycle okay and so from there then you're going to have something that is coming from here okay and which is a word and then we go here to something and then we go there and yeah to finish here so basically this is what we're going to see but now let's just do it with enzymes and vitamins and factors cofactors and everything okay so i'm going to put an open a new slide to start to build this up okay so we have first here folic acid okay so folic acid is going to go directly to tetra hydrofolate tetrahydrofolate it is inside of the folate cycle so this tetrahydrofolate is going to be 510 methylene tetrahydrofolate so we go here turn and this tetrahydrofolate is going to be converted to 510 methylene tetrahydrofolate so this one then is going to be 5-methyl tetrahydrofolate. 5-methyl tetrahydrofolate. But on the way, it's going to find some someone. And this is called the MTHFRB2. So now this one that we're going to find there, I mean, so you need an enzyme to convert this 510 methylene tetrahydrofolate to 5 methyl tetrahydrofolate. And the enzyme uh, um, is called methylene, methylene tetrahydrofolate reductase. So, M for methylene, tetrahydrofolate reductase, okay? And this one requires an enzyme, I mean, this is the enzyme, requires a vitamin, and this is called the vitamin B2. Got it? Um, yeah. So, I will write this word here, the, here, methylene. Methylene tetrafolate reductase. Okay, now one time you have your five methyl, one time you have your five methyl tetrahydrofolate, this five methyl tetrahydrofolate needs to come back to tetrahydrofolate. But in the way coming back to tetrahydrofolate, that is another enzyme. But this enzyme join the other cycle, the which is the methionine cycle, because this cycle that we are doing here, this is the folate cycle. Okay, this in folate cycle needs to join with another cycle that we're going to see right here. And this is going to be the methionine cycle. Methionine cycle. 
So, but this methionine cycle and tetrahyde and, <coughs> and the folate cycle <coughs> has an enzyme in common, and this enzyme is called methionine synthase. So, we need this enzyme, methionine synthase. Methionine synthase use a vitamin, and the vitamin they use is vitamin B12. Okay, so that means that you use your methionine synthase, which requires vitamin B12 to convert 5-methyl tetrahydrofolate to tetrahydrofolate, and tetrahydrofolate comes from the folic acid. Got it? Now, since now we, 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 we were mentioning methionine cycle, so, but this enzyme we mentioned that also works in, in folate cycle and methionine cycle. So, but what does this enzyme, methionine synthase, is going to convert besides to convert 5 methyl tetrahydrofolate to tetrahydrofolate? Well, the other thing that is going to convert is homocysteine. So, but homocysteine, now we enter into the, we are in the uh, methionine cycle. So, we have homocysteine. Um, homocysteine and then this homocysteine is going to be converted to methionine so it's going to be converted to methionine okay and then this this methionine continue here um, yeah so this methionine continue to give you a guy to give you this this is called uh, S adenosyl methionine S adenosyl methionine but this one needs energy so who is going to come in to give you energy Yes, you're right. So ATP. So that means that ATP is coming, and ATP gives you energy to convert this methionine to S adenosyl methionine. This is as I said. Then uh, this S adenosyl methionine go now. go to be as adenosyl homocysteine as adenosyl homocysteine but in uh, in the conversion from as adenosyl homocysteine I mean in the conversion of as adenosyl methionine to as adenosyl homocysteine they were the process of methylation so that's mean that here come methylation. Methylation. Got it? And then this S adenosyl homocysteine come back to be homocysteine. And then homocysteine is going to go to be What do you think is going to be this homocysteine? This homocysteine is going to, come to be cystathione. Cysta. Uh huh. I spelled this wrong. Cysta. Okay, there we go. Cystathione. So this homocysteine to cystathione need an enzyme, and the enzyme is called cystathione. Synthase. So cystathione synthase. Yes. And need an it need a vitamin. <laughs> wow. And the vitamin that you need here is vitamin B six. Whoa. Do you see how important it is this uh, comp uh, vitamin B complex? And now this is cystathione, 
that is uh, over there with uh, after the the conversion of the homocysteine to citation so using citation synthase and vitamin b6 this is citation become cysteine so now cystatione need to be cysteine and this need another enzyme to convert cystationine to convert cystationine actually is uh, here I need to fix this cystationine Yeah, it's cystathionine. There we go. Yeah, so the enzyme that you need to convert cystathionine to cysteine is called cystathionase. Cystathionase. And the vitamin that you need here also is vitamin B6. Got it? Whoa. So that's mean just to recap, in this, in those two pathways, we need vitamin B2, we need vitamin B12, and we need vitamin B6 for folate cycle and the methionine cycle. Well, so with that in mind, I think that we can just stop here and, well, let's just see and then I will, uh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching and remember that we can do all things through Christ who strengthens me, strengthens you, strengthens us. Okay, so thank you. Happy faces. Be full of joy with Jesus. Okay, God bless.